When installing Python packages onto your Ubuntu system, you may notice an error about an externally managed package. For example, let's say that we try to install this package simgrep using the Python installer. And we're assuming that the package has no Ubuntu candidate. So for example, if I do sudo apt install simgrep, I'm going to find that there is no local package for that. And for that reason, I might try to install it using the Python package manager instead. But when you do that, you get this error message that says there's an externally managed environment. So to recap, up to this point, we have an error message about an externally managed environment and there's no native package available directly from Ubuntu in this particular case. When you get to that point, there's a couple of different ways to handle this. The best way to handle it is to install pipx. So you can do sudo apt install pipx, which will do a lot of the background information for you, like setting up the virtual environment. If you install pipx latest, then you can then use pipx to do the installation of the package, like simgrep, for example. So if you want to just have a local copy of the application, you can install it this way. Now, if you want to install a system-wide package, and again, there's no package available natively from the distribution, then you can override the default behavior of pip and pass in the break system package flag, which if there was a system package, would break the system package potentially and cause issues. But if you know that there's no candidate for the package and you want to install an application globally the way that a lot of applications are installed on development machines, then this extra break system package flag can get around the problem and then go ahead and install the package. And at that point, you can just run whatever the package is. In this case, I'm using SimGrep as a demonstration. And you'll be able to use the package normally the way you would expect.